Physics is about uh, nature. Physics, uh, um, the term physics comes from Greek uh, term physics, which means nature itself. So if, for example, biology studies life and chemistry studies more um, what is happening in terms of reactions, uh, um, physics studies what nature is, is about, like, for example, the atmosphere, what is made of, or the stars, what are they, or our planet itself. So if you are interested in nature, uh, not life, uh, or uh, uh, you know how things work more from a chemical point of view, then physics uh, is what you are after. Physics, uh, um, which is also called pure physics, uh, is uh, mainly about uh, the study of the theory behind the physical concepts. Like, for example, you want to know how uh, an object uh, falls because of gravity, then if you uh, study pure physics, you will study purely like Newton laws, etc. If you do apply physics, you will see how Newton laws, for example, apply to an object falling because of gravity. So it's more the application of, uh, of the theory, of physical concepts. I was curious. I've always been driven by curiosity. Since a child, whatever I was seeing, I wanted to know how the thing was working. So I was a typical child who was basically tearing apart a clock just because I wanted to know what was inside. So uh, that's what uh, uh, made me become a physicist. Um, I, I was just curious about everything, and in particular about how nature was working. Every time I was going anywhere and I was seeing something natural happening or some instrument uh, um, doing something, I was just curious to know why. And so that's why I became a physicist. Well, a physicist can basically do any type of job, really. Um, even though you don't become a physicist, for example, a researcher in academia or industry, like a research and development department in industry, uh, whatever you are interested in, um, if you are well, if you're a physicist or you have a degree in physics, you will certainly be capable to do it. Um, physics applies basically to any branch of science and even outside science, like law, for example. If you want to become a patent lawyer, you must have a degree in science, for example, physics. Or if you want to become a medical physicist, well, again, you must have a degree in physics and so on. So whatever you want to do, physics certainly will help. Even though someone is not necessarily interested in becoming a physicist, in the sense a researcher who just shut himself in a lab, uh, but is more interested in um, applying um, physics to something, then physics is for that person. Even if you want to become um, like a, a, an economic uh, um, analyst, then physics could be a good choice because it will give you the skills to become a good analyst, and many people do that. So it, it just if you want to broaden basically um, your chances to get a good job um, when you, you go and, and find for well find for a job um, then physics is certainly the best option because of the broadening of op opportunities and possibilities that it will give you.